Virtual Field Trip of Bald Head Island. Welcome to Bald Head Island. Bald Head Island is an amazing island that is two miles off of North Carolina's coast, Southport. Southport is about 45 minutes from Wilmington, North Carolina. An island is a piece of land that is surrounded only by water. Bald Head Island is about 5.7 miles squared. This map shows where Bald Head Island is located in North Carolina. The island is a great place to visit if you are near Southport. You can take the ferry boat there. There are multiple daily trips from Southport to Bald Head Island. I live on the river in Wilmington, North Carolina, so I'm able to take a private boat to Bald Head Island in about 30 to 40 minutes. Private boats can be docked in the Bald Head Island Marina. If you are not able to take a boat or a ferry to the island, then don't fret! This video will take you on a virtual field trip of the island. Some history and all the fun stuff you can do there. Once you get on the island, you have to get around by bike or golf cart. There's a place to rent them on the island, or you can bring your own bike. On the coast of most islands and other dangerous coasts, there are lighthouses. A lighthouse is a tall tower that shines a bright light at the very top. The purpose of a lighthouse is to warn boats that there is land so they won't crash or they will know where to go. This is Old Baldy. In the shadow of Old Baldy, overlooking the marsh and Baldhead Creek, the Smith Island Museum is surrounded by history. From the ancient live oaks to the earthwork remains of Fort Holm, the site is ideally suited to the reconstructed lighthouse keeper's cottage. North of the lighthouse are remains of Lighthouse Creek Pier, which originally extended to the lighthouse door. Only a few feet east of the lighthouse is the brick oil house that once stored barrels of oil for the light. To the east is the chapel, which although built in 1987, blends its architectural style with a dignity and grace befitting its historical setting. This is the church I was just talking about. As I was saying, the architecture is just beautiful. The outside, the trees hang above the church and it just looks so pretty. Here is a picture of the inside of the church. I think the architecture is just so beautiful. And here's another picture of the inside of it. After golf carting a little bit ways down the road, you can find the Bald Head Island Conservancy, where you can find turtles and alligators. I used to come here when I was little, and I would take pictures of the little alligators and the turtles in the water, and it was so exciting to see that. This is a picture of where the alligators and the turtles usually hang out. They weren't there today, but on another day, you can see them hanging out there. After golf carting a little bit farther down into the Bald Head Island, you can find many accesses to white sandy beaches where you can sit and relax and tan and do whatever you want on the beach. There's also two pools you can go to to tan and chill and relax on the island. There are also other fun things to do on the island, such as kayak through the creek. Baldhead also has amazing restaurants where you can eat dinner and enjoy wonderful food. I hope you enjoyed the virtual field trip of Baldhead Island.